All right, Game Maker How To. Make a health bar pop up when the mouse moves over your enemy or your monster or whatever it is you want. Um, just so you know, I'm building off the tutorial monster health bar here. And I'm just going to add that code that makes it actually just draw when the mouse is over the object. Now I'm going to do a little quick way. Uh, just so beginners, this is probably the fastest way to it. You'll see here what we did in our monster before is we had this draw method. And then a draw method, we drew out the health bar. So that was the health bar code. And of course, we also had to draw the sprite for the monster too, since we are uh, modifying the draw event. Now, all I'm going to do here is this health bar is being drawn all the time. Now, while it's not the greatest thing to ask a lot of if statements and do a lot of code inside of the draw event, this one's pretty short and quick and easy, so I'll do it here, is I don't want to do all this code unless the mouse is close by or on top of our object. Now, while there are methods in GameMaker to check is the mouse actually over our object, I find a faster one is just to do the, uh, the approximation. Let's just ask about the distance of the mouse to this character and if it's close enough I'll draw the health bar and I find this one's great because it'll actually if uh, there's a couple monsters close by just getting the mouse nearby will highlight the health bars for all of them so here I go um, how far away how far away this monster is let's make this a variable here that I'm just gonna use temporarily I should actually do this how far well that's a bad name how far and I'm going to say how far equals, and I'm going to use a game maker method called point distance, which will calculate distances for me. And what I want to do is I want to know from this monster that I'm coding inside of right now. And so I have to give it X and Y of one position. So that's going to be X and Y of my monster. And then I have to give it another X and Y to another location. And this other location is going to be the mouse's X and the mouse's Y position. And then I'm going to ask a quick question. Once this calculates the distance for me, I'm just going to see if I'm close enough to draw the health bar. So I'm going to say if how far is under. Now I know my sprites are, I think, 32 by 32 pixels. So I don't know. Let's just go for, uh, let's just go for something like a 20 or a 24. If I'm less than 24 pixels away from the mouse, let's do a little good indentation here. Then I do all that code in that block, okay, between the curly braces. So hopefully this makes sense to you there, right? I draw my sprite out. I calculate how far away the mouse is. If the distance is less than 24, then I do all that same code I normally did for the bar. All right, let's cross our fingers, see if it works. So notice the draw event always drawing the ghosts out, but when I get close, it draws the health bar. And remember, no clicking here, right? This is just plain and simple. Mouse is close by. So I think I nailed the distance there pretty close, right? 24. Seems to do the job. Nice. And if I actually fire with the player, right? It's perfect. Nice little option. Hopefully that gives you some ideas. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.